Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for the Cancer Sun, Moon, and Horizon. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, this is the Energy Vibration for the third week of June, and it's for the Cancers, okay? Thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful support, likes, and shares. Um, this is a general reading. Not everything will um, is for everyone um there can be different energies that is coming out for different people okay so um some of you could be um receiving good news um sometimes news good news come up where there are heartbreaks um that come up but this is a week where you could receive in some good news and it depends on where you, you are. But if you have done something injustice to someone else, then that good news is not going to be happening. OK, please remember to go back and listen to the monthly readings, because in the uh, monthly readings in the third week, you will also receive a message about this week. OK, Monday, you had the three of swords. Um, which is here on Monday. On Tuesday, um, things are going to be coming out, secrets and things are going to be coming out, okay? On Wednesday, you're feeling left out in the cold for whatever reason it is, and it has to do with your materialistic world that you feel left out in the cold way, okay? Um, all right, so... Friday is going to be um, one of your best days of this week. Friday, Saturday, you are going to be working with others to bring. And um, a Sunday, you're going to finally see a situation um, about the Queen of Pentacles. OK, um, whatever the situation is with, between you and this person, um, you are going to be seeing what exactly has happened. Let's see what is this heartbreak about. The heartbreak that is coming in has to do with some of you who are connected to someone who is an Aries, Leo or Sagittarius. Now, this could be your partner. So if um, your partner is between the ages of 25 and 40, this could be your partner that there is an heartbreak that he's going to want to end a relationship with you. So. Um, some of you, this could be a situation with your son, but I'm seeing here because the house, the stable foundation is no more going to be there. And the energy of the cross came up here with saying with the energy of the cross that someone basically, um, wants to hand something with you. And it has to do with someone, um, and is a, is a, is an, um, um, someone is the end of a relationship or the end of a contract. Some of you are going to receive the end of a relationship or the end of a contract with someone um, who is, a, um, and it's a man who is a Taurus, who is an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarian, okay? Um, sometimes endings need to happen so a new beginning can come out because with this ending, this ending that is coming in with this person, the energy of the sun is here, um, which is saying this ending has to happen. It was a karmatic situation because it crosses here with the sun. So what this is saying is that whatever the relationship that you had with someone who is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, and they decide to move on and move away, it could be your daughter, it could be someone, but um, whoever that person is, this ending has to, it was a karmatic situation, and now it's coming out. Okay, there is the energy of um, breakthroughs, news that is coming about an hardship or you feel as if and you're seeing a situation for what it is, whatever it was and whatever was playing. Um, there is a situation where you're seeing the truth of this situation. OK, um, you're seeing who this person is. You're seeing the truth about this person and you're having some regrets because um, it's as if this person had got you in this situation. Whoever this person is, this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, has gotten you in this situation. And now um, you have worked with this person and now you're seeing the truth of a situation and you are having some regrets, okay? The outcomes is that you are going to be going on a new journey. You're going to be moving forward in your life and some of you could be leaving um, 
um, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian and moving forward with someone um, with um, a, um, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person okay some of you are going to decide um, to move forward and go on a journey with a, a Capri a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person okay whatever the situation and whoever has broken your heart this is someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and you're moving away from this person you're going to start a new journey with this um, lady who is a are uh, with this lady who is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this could be that um, you're seeing a situation and you're starting over with your mom the energy of balance comes in and this is when the angels or guides are coming in to say to you um, you know um, balance out the situation whatever the situation is it's as if your angels and guides are saying uh, try and balance out the situation you need to understand uh, that you need to balance out the situation whatever the situation is whatever that has transpired you need to find inner strength to move forward with the situation okay um, the outcomes is going to be the ten of cups um, whatever the situation is um, that is transparent in your life whatever the situation is that is transparent in your life um, you're going to find balance to balance out a family situation okay um, because some of you are going to be seeing the truth of a situation some of you um, have been with someone who's an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and um, you lived with that person but you, your heart is now broken um, whatever the situation is is as if um, this person has broken your heart okay it was a karmatic situation yeah 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 I'm sorry yeah this person has broken your heart come 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 I'm sorry honey so, <laughs> it's my son at the door so let's see what is going to be the outcomes of this um, week for you cancers yes heartbreaks um you ca you cancers are going to go through a situation where there is a heartbreaks okay there is heartbreaks coming in for some of you there's heartbreaks in a house situation um, a, um, a wedding um, there is the end of a marriage and with this end of the marriage you are going to be moving forward and looking for the Queen of Pentacles and this is a Capricorn person there's a lot of talking about what is happening there's a lot of talking there's a lot of people um, a lot of talking about what is happening a lot of um, people are talking about the situation and it has to do with a marriage that has come to an end As some of you your marriage is, is going to come to an end um, or someone is going to be um, who you know if you're dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius they are going to be ending a relationship with you there is going to be a lot of conflicts the conflicts you could be having is with um, a lady um, and this is someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn there is going to be you're going to be having a lot of conflicts with this lady a lot of quarrels with this lady and that sort of a situation but there is a light to the end of the tower um, your family is going to be standing by you for whatever the situation is your family is going to be standing um, by you and do not um, go in a conflict with someone to say that she is the one who has ruined your life because uh, um, each and every person have uh, make their choices and whatever the situation is you're walking away from that and you're going towards uh, um, the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person and this um, person you're going to have some conflicts with this person there's going to be a lot of talking a lot of judgment calls and that sort of a thing and this is because um, it's just time that your marriage ends it's, it has nothing to do with this lady 
it's going to be a very stressful week for you cancers whatever is happening it's going to be a very stressful week okay some of you could be going to this um um a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person to speak over a situation and to see um how they can help you um it, it could be that you're um looking um up um help or asking this person for help um to 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 deal with your stressful situation because this is a stressful situation that you are going to be dealing with it's as if you are going to decide to um connect with this person who is a Taurus Virgo or a Cancer you're going to talk about the things and it could be um, um, arguments um, because you're very stressed but um, if you're going to be arguing with this person they're kind they're going to kind of I'm not taking your stress on okay but there is balance that is going to come in your family whatever the situation and whatever is happening there is a sense of balance that is going to come in your family okay so I want to say to each and every person um, it's going to be a stressful week but nonetheless um, ask for your spirit guides for help go to that person if you can speak to that Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person do not go upsetting because if you are very upset they are going to just you know leave you behind and that sort of a thing so I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back um, please remember to listen to your Sun Moon Arising sign namaste until next time <music>